Hi, my name is Lydia. I am a science ambassador here at the University of Texas at Arlington. Today, I'm going to show you guys something pretty cool that has to do with liquid nitrogen. So, as you can see, I have a teapot here. A teapot is used for, well, you guessed it, tea. Usually, whenever I make tea, I like to add water, put it on a hot stove top, let it boil, which creates pressure, and makes a whistling sound to let me know, hey, my water is ready for tea. So, instead of using a hot substance like boiling water, today I'm going to use a cold substance called... This is liquid nitrogen. And I'm just going to pour it into this bucket to make it a little bit easier for me to put into the teapot. So now let's see if a teapot will make a whistling sound with liquid nitrogen instead of boiling water. So the answer is yes, liquid nitrogen can make a teapot whistle. And that's because liquid nitrogen burns at negative 320 degrees Fahrenheit, whereas boiling water boils at 212 degrees Fahrenheit. That's quite a difference, about 500 degrees or so. And even though they are completely different spectrums of hot and cold, the boiling creates pressure, just like it did here, and creates a whistling sound. Now you can't use liquid nitrogen for tea, but you can use it to make a teapot whistle. Thank you guys so much for joining us and we hope to see you next time. Please like and subscribe. Bye.